Thank you very much, um, <clears throat> very much. Uh, like Madam Ministers, I'm, I'm here very pleased to see that uh, we've managed to open one chapter um, again in the accession negotiations with, um, with Serbia. This will move the country uh, further in the accession process uh, towards joining the European Union as, uh, as full member. Uh, we thank the efforts of the, of the Finnish presidency. We know that it, uh, it wasn't easy uh, all along, but at the end, uh, you have managed to conclude uh, this result. Uh, this is very important, um, and this is very important also for the new commission. The new commission uh, is fully committed uh, to the uh, EU perspective for the whole of the Western Balkans. Uh, I will work as my personal priority uh, for the enlargement uh, of the Western Balkans. And we hope to have at least one of these uh, countries ready to join at the end of uh, our term, at the end of this term uh, uh, of the Commission. This would bring tangible benefits not only uh, for Serbia, but uh, for the people uh, of Serbia in short term. This is, my, uh, this is my main goal. Uh, today, uh, the outcome of the Intergovernmental Conference uh, is a very positive signal, um, not only for Serbia, but for the whole region. It shows that uh, the enlargement uh, policy and the integration process uh, of, the, of, the, of the Western Balkans is an important strategic objective of the EU, not only the Commission, but also of the Member States. This is a very important uh, development uh, that we need to uh, remark. Uh, we have been able to open uh, the chapter on the free movement of capital because we have seen that there is progress uh, in the reforms uh, in Serbia. We consider the free movement of capital to be a backbone uh, of EU membership. It's part of the four freedoms, the funding freedoms uh, of the internal market, without which uh, it is impossible uh, to become a member. Uh, we have seen that um, Serbia has made significant progress uh, on the free movement of capital, on secured uh, payment systems, uh, prevention of money laundering, uh, or uh, a healthy and attractive business environment. But of course, work still needs to be done, and we are here to help uh, Serbia uh, to, to conclude on that work uh, very quickly, and hopefully uh, to move ahead to, to other chapters already, already next year. Uh, the free movement of capital is also a prerequisite uh, for any increase in foreign direct investment uh, for Serbia. So we will encourage uh, Serbia to, to engage more and more uh, in this area uh, as one of the key objectives of the next commission is to bring uh, the Western Balkans closer uh, to Europe, closer uh, in everyday life, closer in uh, economic development, and closer in integrating uh, into the European Union. Uh, this makes um, uh, it even more important that Serbia continues with the reform uh, agenda. Uh, and as uh, a negotiating country, one of the front runners, uh, it, it should also set uh, an example uh, to other countries uh, in, the, in the region. We think that uh, there's still quite a bit of work to do, but uh, we're hopeful and we're encouraged by today's development that this work will bring results. We will try to speed up and dynamize the process, as I have explained at the General Affairs Council uh, today. Uh, and the Commission stands ready uh, to work as much as, as, is, as it is necessary. And it will start very quickly already uh, in January uh, to speed up things and dynamize uh, the accession process.